good morning. I wanted to get started early here before the sun came up because I want to show you Mr. Green. <laughs> this is, I think, the third bloom of Mr. Green. It's kind of weird, um, and I don't know if there's a reason for it. The one sepal went off to the right there. Eh, probably just random. Pretty bloom, though. <laughs> you can see I stripped the pollen off of it. Gonna put it all over the garden this morning. Very uh, fun day to hybridize with. All right, I'll show you some others. Your daily Dr. Francis Baker shot. I was impressed with today's bloom of prophetic voice from Carol Emmerich. That's pretty. Here's the glowing fields from Guy Pierce. Things are just opening up right now. Some are not open yet, so we'll go all the way down to the end here. Here is your daily installment of Minnesota Key from Tim Bell. There it is. And I think we're on the last bloom of King Bee from Tom Polston. Got a seedling down here. It's kind of pretty. This is out of Shannara and Dr. Francis Baker. It's, it's all right, you know, it's okay. All right, I'm gonna shut it off there. Had to show you uh, James Bond this morning from David Kirchhoff. It's one of the prettier reds in the garden. I got a little bit of pollen on there because I was crossing it with sips of sin. It's really pretty. And then you can see this from a distance. Flourish of trumpets. Pretty yellow diploid. Lots of blooms today. All right. And there's uh, the pink flamingo. <laughs> Here we are out in the purple bed. It's a nice, cool morning. And there's some cool seedlings. We'll start out with Justin Tor. Showing off its nice, tall scapes. Here's a seedling out of Gary Butchak. Here's a seedling out of Dr. Francis Baker. With the bee. Here's another one. This is a different one. Dr. Francis Baker and Justin Tor. Not bad. Here's an interesting seedling I've been keeping my eye on. This one I believe is also out of, let's see, Justin Tor is one of them. Let me see if I can figure out the other name. In the cross, Trouble in Paradise. That's nice. Flag that one. All right, looks like Ben Tor is wrapping up the season. How am I going to get out of here? <laughs> Let's jump through here. I got to show you a couple of uh, cool daylilies this morning. Let's start out with this is Rich Howard's Later Seder. Bluminance. A lot of blooms there. Here's Elaine Seifert's Pitbull Princess today. Here's my Frank Harnaker, named for a good friend of mine. And here's Elaine Seifert's Denim and Lace. Denim and Lace is going to town. Really going to town. Looks like some of the bees got to the pollen before I did. Okay, let's come up this row. Zinnia 
Adam on data continues. Here's the late season stars. This is Mango Crush doing its thing. Gotta slide between the pods for this one. God, it's not easy in this garden. Here is two blooms of Mirar La Planta. Both of these dailies are from Kurt Hansen. And both have really good late season um, blooms for a long period of time. Look at that scape, that's Mango Crush. Great late season daily. All right. Boy, things are just fading so fast. I'm gonna have to start showing you pods. <laughs> Here's Peggy Campbell, my late season polychrome, named for my aunt. She was a wonderful person. I think I'm gonna bring it to a close. That's it for today, guys. Just a few still in bloom.